today we have blue agate this beautiful blue agate can you see and this blue agate is to help you to speak your truth to help you to be able to be in that state and space of speaking your truth with love and kindness and i have two kinds here the first kind is in its natural state so this is the like the rough diamond like the the blue agate stone you'd think that was a stone wouldn't you and then you can see how beautiful it is inside and so we're calling upon the archangels who are going to help us to speak our truth. I called Archangel Michael and boy, does he help you speak your truth. I'm sitting here, I'm really hot. Because <laughs> when you call Archangel Michael, he brings in his heat, the fire. Um, you know, I used to have hot flushes at 17 and didn't understand why. <laughs> now I understand why. It's the energy of Archangel Michael. So whenever you feel that you need to clear something or there's any shock or any any fears or or um, trauma that happens. I mean, sometimes it's the slow shock and trauma that we encounter that you know just sort of creeps up on us, and all of a sudden we realise we're grinding our teeth at night, and you know we're like, mm. you know, are you feeling like that? I know I am. <laughs> so this beautiful blue agate here, and when the blue agate it can become become. I'm going to get this wrong. Cal Sydney is its uh, next uh, next um, incarnation, the, ne the next step of it. And this is the same with this beautiful stone. When you hold it at your throat, helping you to speak your truth to yourself, calling in Archangel Michael. Archangel Michael, who is the Archangel of Protection, but also of Justice. So you don't have to meter out the justice, you don't have to get angry. You just call Archangel Michael and trust that he will send his healing light to all of those that need their lessons, their karma or, or their love and forgiveness. Because often when people are, uh, they are nasty to you, it's because they're in fear. And so to open your throat chakra, it's like opening your third eye. You have to clear and cleanse and open your sacral chakra. So you can see I'm holding the smoky quartz here. So the Archangel of the smoky quartz, Archangel Gabriel, really bringing in that energy to help you to speak your truth to bring love and understanding to to you at, at this time and of course the other crystal that will help you to do this is the lapis lazuli I don't you love that the blue and the gold really really reminds me of Archangel Michael he is the Archangel who is on this planet at the moment bringing more love and light and energy to us uh, um, during this time of lockdown because it is a time of of sorting out your head your heart we're in the flow of the new moon as well and this new moon energy is is really bringing in the choices your mental choice or your emotional choice your uh, uh, energy at your heart and so with the two smoky quartzes today these are beautiful pieces from Kenya and we are going to really hold the energy for you here bringing this love from the heart of Avalon to wherever you are in the world wherever you are in the world we have Amma behind us the goddess divine goddess Amma Amma, um, Amma who is this beautiful being of light who is who blesses our planet to help us to see the compassion to act in in compassionate ways um, with ourselves and with all others. We are all her children. And it is um, the motivational message today is about um, taking care and loving your children. Oh, it made me cry. It was so beautiful. A grandma talking about her children and how she would really, if she had her time again, you know, not tell them to shut the doors, slam the doors. She would just be able to sit with them and, and you know, not worry about a, a, a messy bedroom or doing your homework, but just to love one another, to love her children and to really take that time of being the mum with the new new children. I know I have three children and um, five grandchildren and I can't wait to see them. It's been so long now um, and so we we 
take this time to to just have the choices in our in our hearts in our minds and in our guts in our sacral chakra because this is the place of earthing of anchoring of being safe being strong these two beautiful pieces of of uh, smoky quartz here and uh, and when you bring the energy down here the hot flash seems to have disappeared so hallelujah <laughs> <laughs> it's um, a problem that uh, that you get at a certain age. Hallelujah! And if we didn't have it, we'd be even more upset, wouldn't we? <laughs> um, so this beautiful light from the angels, from all of the angels of Avalon, the angels of alchemy, the angels of Atlantis. We're calling the angels um, from awareness, the angels of ascension this beautiful rainbow colored light flowing now from the top of your head bringing this light through from the top of your head to the tip of your toes i'm going to show you the rainbow light of my wand that um, i talked about yesterday this is the wand that we made from a stick and this is the wand that brings the energy through how do you make a stick into a wand with intention with love, with the, uh, the movement, the creativity to really bring the divine into that space. We made this wand with a little bit of, of um, diamond herkimer in the top here, clear quartz crystal, and it still has the blue tack on the end, which uh, Ronnie, my uh, grandson and I put on there when we made it. And so the uh, the crystal is held in place with the multicolours of the ribbons that um, signify a principle. These principles are the principles that the angels have given us here to help us uh, um, through our process of ascension, our process of being. And so as we see and we feel this energy now flowing from heaven to earth, just close your eyes, Take in that beautiful big breath of creation, that breath of love, that breath of life, that breath of light that fills your body as it flows from the great central sun. Yes, that's the sun in the sky. The cosmic great central sun is within the centre of the galaxy, the centre of our universe. We have many central suns. And as this light flows through from your central sun, through to your monad, through to your soul star, all the way down through your body, through to your heart star, this beautiful space in the centre of your heart as we hold this space and place of love. And as it flows down to our root chakra, earthing, anchoring, grounding, the more earthed you are, the higher you can fly, the more angels you can connect with, the more earthed and anchored you are, the safer and more secure you feel. And as you feel this light in the centre of the heart of Mother Earth, this beautiful light, bringing this light from the heart of Mother Earth to the centre of your heart, and then beaming it out, beaming it out as you beam out this light to the energies of your environment, wherever you are, we're sending you the light from Avalon, sending you this light, sending you this love, sending you this energy to transform your fears into your dreams, to transform your intentions, your sticks into your wand, to transform this fear into your creativity. What are you going to have achieved this year, 2020? When we look back, when we see the 2020 vision of, of the blessing that this year has given us, it's going to be phenomenal absolutely amazing do not miss your ascension do not miss this this wave that is flowing right now this new moon in gemini is extremely important use it for writing for being for for really getting in touch with yourself take time take 
take time to smell the daisies, take time to smell the roses, take time to smell the lilies and be in love as we beam this energy to you right now, sending you the light, the love, the healing of the angels as we send you this energy We're thinking of doing an hour question and answers. If you'd like that, please let me know and we'll arrange a date. And then tell me which day would be most appropriate for you because this is co-creation. We're out in this together. Same ocean, different boats. Lots of love. Mwah.